Boom, 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 boom. We're actually about the golden age. We'll probably overkill the first age a bunch. Uh, I should take away the production focus, although I'm betting they work exactly the same tiles. I really get the first. Well, I mean, we we did ninja the Stonehenge like crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's not hard. All we had to do was restart re five times. Many useful objects. See, it's totally easy. You're right. I undersold the difficulty. Um, I think I'm gonna go urban planning for the production still. I'm still gonna run. I think discipline over here. What we want to do is we want to get the thing that gives us the uh, the colonization thing, which is what is it early um early empire gives us colonization. Well, let's start with that first. I mean, again, what we're doing really is we're shooting for political philosophy. Oh, many barbarians. Writing means sharing. Writing is done. We'll get bronze working. We've got the boost. We'll find out that we have no iron. Actually, I should have just stood there. Hey, Harold. Yeah, I shouldn't have attacked. I should have just uh, fortified up here. Okay, he's just fortifying in response. We'll do this. Uh, you're going to chill there. You're chilling here because we want to make sure we can settle a few of these places. Um, I was going to buy, but Builders is probably going to buy it at our expansion. Although, um, we could do a little bit with a builder in our capital now that I think about it. Unless... We're going to get our governor title here. We could wait, maybe get Liang. Now, it's pretty far away. We can improve this. Okay. You know, um, oh, no. We need irrigation for that. Right. I'm going to wait here. Um, can't quite buy a settler. We might be able to in a little bit if we hit a goody hut. I don't think a builder right now helps. I think I missed a whiskey and chocolate. Oh, oh my god, yes I did. Seven minutes ago, terribly sorry. Kregoros, thank you very much. It's always a good day when you're streaming Civ. Now you just have to top the way the run as the Gauls ended. No spoilers, wow. Yeah, I did not expect that run to be so insane. I'm not gonna buy a builder right now. Um, it was, it was crazy. We have no luxuries, we're already running out of amenities. Got some bits, thank you very much. Faithful Twitch Primalist, whose solely him symbol is a cow. When you build a science-focused city, name it Ox Ford. Okay, that's really funny. All right, you're done. You shrank, so you no longer complain about your amenities. Um, I do want a campus. I, I'm wondering about another settler right away. I think I have to go for another settler right away. And yeah, we want to expand somewhere west first, I would suggest. Because this is a city-state. Yeah, so our expansion to the south is pretty okay. Let's just get a couple on this river, maybe. Settler, builder, campus. That that actually sounds pretty good, Dynalon. We have enough money to buy another uh, the builder. Or we might just want to buy a trader. In our first city that we plant down. Which is going to be where? Thing is, without perfect knowledge of everything over here, we don't really know exactly where we want to min-max all of our city placements. I think if I just settled here next to the sugar, or actually, maybe what I'll do is, here's an idea. We'll settle maybe even next to the wheat, buy a builder, improve the wheat to get the boost to irrigation. I mean, I guess there's a couple of different wheats over here that we can settle next to. Um... Maybe, actually, maybe further north looks a little good. Yeah, we're going to take a look. Uh, and yeah, hopefully we can get an error score. It'd be annoying to miss a golden age by one. Although I'm not sure what we can do to earn an error score here, you guys. Yeah, I think I'm just going to settle between these two wheats. Between the copper and the spice. 
Oh, that was, I think, from down here, right? Yeah, I think um, I, this knocks spice. It's a red maze. But if we settle here, we can still settle here after. And that's what I was thinking. I think this is a great site for a city. Um, but we're not preventing that if we settle over here. Yeah, I was going to say, we should hopefully get error score by settling. But will we get there in time? I don't know. Buying our first trade route, I don't think we'll do it. I don't think you get error score for that, right? Hmm. Oh, yeah, we could, we could do a little dot mapping. So we're going to put a city there. And then see, one, two, three. So four could be over here. So we could city there. I'm sure, there'll be overlap between these two, but it doesn't really matter because they're not overlapping. Like, like I guess they overlap the sugar because this city here could work the sugar, but that's going to be fine. We'll do something like that. And then we've got room for another city. One, two, three, four. We could even put a city down here. I don't know if we will right there, but that's another legal city placement. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah. So we could do something like that, and then we could backfill behind us. Uh, I was going to say, buy ship for error score, but that's one of the reasons I loaded this up. We don't actually have a ship in the thing. We don't have the tech. So, no good. Uh, good Venetian Arsenal... Or, oh, Venetian Arsenal site. Um, yeah, we'll take a look for that. Um, I think we're going to... It says two turns. So I said it'll say next one turn, next turn. Then when next turn, we can move and then settle. And hopefully we do get that error score. Let me stand here, just to make sure this guy doesn't move in the tile that I want. Cobble's not actually going to go for my Settler, so that's going to be fine. Found City. We didn't get it? We didn't even get the Eyes the River Warily thing? No error score from that either. Huh. Already had it from the capital. Oh, because it was next to a river. Right. Which is why we have so much error score. But it will be annoying to miss the golden age by one. Because then it'll just make the next era that much more expensive. And we'll probably go normal into dark. Uh, right about the time that um, loyalty starts to become a problem. Francois! Merci beaucoup. Uh, so thanks for all the entertainment the of all the salty restarts. <laughs> there were a few salty restarts. There's no doubt about that. Iron is not currently anywhere in our borders. I run, search, found one result. Oh, way up in the north over here. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't think anyone's going to steal that iron from us, but I also don't know when we're going to get it. I think we have a lot of Eurekas. We're going to Eureka this. Minor re I think Eureka might give us... Um, I think the Inquiry is going to give us maybe a little bit more. No Golden Age. That is that is kind of frustrating. Um, I mean, at some point... Actually, you know what? We're going to need Archery. Let's start. Let's do that. We'll do a little exploring over here, I guess. Um, oh, we actually have a mission. Okay, that should be relatively safe from barbarians. Let's do this. I mean, I wanted the growth and things, but the gold is still good. And then that gives us the boost. And then we get a Eureka, which gives us error score for next time. Yeah, building walls wouldn't be bad. Um, but right now we've got to we've got to continue being greedy a little bit. I mean, I could, like, do this. I don't really want to save scum that much, though. Um, but we do have to be greedy to try to get back into the game. We've got the religion. Now we have to not fall cripplingly behind on all the things. I mean, we're still making no science, which is, of course, I mean, actually fairly difficult at this stage in the game. Uh, you rest there. Here's this. Not enough money to do it. I mean, maybe buy a tile, but who cares about that? I'm happy we haven't seen opposing oh, settlers yet. That's good. But we, we seem to have some space to expand. Which is really nice to see. Oracle, pyramids are done. Harold and John Curtin. I didn't even realize they were at war. If there are path. no dogs in heaven. 
animal husbandry into archery is going to be great. I do want a campus, but I think I think we have to keep going settlers right now. We'll just delay the campus a little bit longer. Let me settle down here, and then we'll grab the spot in the middle, perhaps. And this guy actually is still pretty important because we are running a trade route over here. Maybe I will keep him spotting. Um, and you are going to just cycle back over to protect the settler. Oh, rename Odessa. Thank you very much. We do have some horses over there. That is true. Draw entrant. Hungry Hodor! Hodor. Uh, I miss when uh, Game of Thrones is like the most exciting. Oops, that did not actually copy correctly. I did pick only Shen. That was weird. I guess I still had it in my, um, my paste. Okay. Hodor. Oh, speaking of Hodor, what are you working? Mm, no, you have to be growth focused. Looks like he wasn't the only Shen. Haha. Uh, -huh. uh, yeah. Come back over here so we can do a little escorty stuff. Look back over the past. I hate the color of cobble because I keep thinking it's barbarian all the time. Road. Colonization, we're going to put you in right now. Like we're still going to run discipline. Governor, uh, we're going to appoint Liang. And we're going to put you in Hungry Hordor, which is building a builder. Australia is happy. That's true. Good point. Declare friendship. Excellent. It's same exact color as cobble, which isn't confusing at all. Sure. I shot an arrow into the air. All right. There's archery done. I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna grab masonry. We have it boosted, and we might want to do some early wall stuff. I think I still like the idea of expanding here first. Norway levy. Ah! It's a little annoying. Uh, I guess it doesn't change how many turns it'll take us to get there. No, it doesn't. Okay, that's fine. Now these... I was going to say, if neither one of these two bastards move, then one of them move back over here, I'll also be kind of annoyed, but what are you going to do, right? Um, I guess smack that guy. Don't, okay. Whew. Yeah, I still like the idea of settling here. Antioch, the place we get holy hand grenades, except it's going to be the holy hand grenades of Radical instead. Boom. Radical! Welcome to the Empire. What I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to start on an archer. We have to we have to get a few military units so that you know we dissuade the AI from maybe declaring on us, and we want to get the three archers so that we can get a boost. Um, so that's going to be actually I guess you can be upgraded into an archer, but I think what's going to happen here is we're going to purchase a builder. Yes. And I'm just going to explore a little bit without getting too far away from Radical. Uh, keep going. What is negative loyalty? To whom? Oh! The Kree's right over there. I think I'm going to try to plop down a city here sooner rather than later then. And then we'll, we'll fill in the middle afterwards. Stone circles. He might be running by, back to a base, but I'll heal here first anyway. Radical hand grenade does sound vicious. Yeah, it sounds pretty good, right? 
Liang is here, the builder is builderizing. OU need to be on growth focus just in case. And then over here, I'm gonna cancel this and then, yeah, that's fine because you can get your builder maybe a little sooner. You're not growing right now, but you weren't on the cusp and then we'll go and improve this and then that should be okay. You're doing this, specialty district, we might swap out of this at some point. Okay, that's good. We met three city-state, that's great. Oh, we wanna get the first level of Bandai Brunei so that we do get the gold. That's good. Um, I'm going to pop this just to get some vision. And these are hills. Yeah, I'm going to chop the rainforest and build a farm on top of that. Iron tile, five tiles west of Rodical. Don't know if that's in the cards for us. We will see. I'm going to start working on ir irrigation because we are going to get the boost to it relatively soon. And there's definitely some tiles we want to improve with that. Man, this mountain range is going to be really good for our defenses. We could even put like an encampment over here if we really work. In fact, um, when I get a little money, I think I will buy this tile because I don't want this city to expand this way. Most likely it's just going to grab its other sugar, which is fine. We're not competing for it. Do we have... We don't have the Sailing Eureka. I could settle on the coast um, to get the Eureka and to make a non-terrible campus or a um, um, harbor. The plus two gold. I don't think any of the tiles are particularly important. The further south I move, the less overlap there is with only Shen. The more overlap there is over here. It gets a little closer to the stone. I think I'm going to settle here because it's going to be a little easier to get the stone. And it gives us the Eureka. So I'm going to do that. On the forest? That's interesting. And Mountain Pass City would also be kind of cool. But I'm not worried about bottleneck going over here because it's going to be protected by our stuff. Whereas this does. Do we just put it on this forest? It'll make it that much easier. We'll get, we'd get the stone right away. and I wouldn't have to worry about this. Um, I mean, Venetian Arsenal is possible basically anywhere. Like I could, you know, regardless of sort of where I settle. Actually, I think I might like settling on the forest better. Unless, on the other hand, um, what about where, where campus? Where campus? Well, I mean, this is a three tile adjacency. If we eat the tobacco, we could have a four tile adjacency. I don't know if that's worth it. Yeah, whereas this is adjacent to two mountains and it's good for other things. No, I think we settle right here. I think we settle right here and then we can leave some more mountain tiles open. There is going to have be a lot of mountain tiles. If we move that way, it adds more. This gives us a little bit more land that we can work. I think I like this just fine. And our final city of the stream, because we're going to be ramping this up, Pantera! Pantera 74. May your city grow big and impressively. Much bigly. We don't have enough money to buy a unit, and we might want to buy a tile over here. I don't, we're not too worried about rushing walls. I mean, the Cree are like out over here, but not too far away. Um, just a monument for some growth might be okay. We could also just immediately start a campus. It'd be nice to chop the trees first, but it might not be in the cards. There's a better campus location, but at the same time, it's also a better, um, uh, it's also a better holy site location. We'll say it here, especially if I don't want to chop the tobacco, which I don't think I do. I think the tobacco, we just want to work. So campus or we holy site, one way or the other. Campus or holy site, they're both, they're both equivalent. Um, in terms of what we build. First, we already have a religion. So I'm tempted, I think, to go campus first. I don't know if... I don't, chat's not really saying anything. I'm assuming because there's not really a strong incentive one way or another. I think, like, I'm sort of picturing it, so we're feeling six of one, half a dozen of the other. There's reasons I want one first. There's reasons I want another. Um, I think we campus, and I think I put it down here. So this way we get the campus sooner, but not as much adjacency. And we get the holy site next, but with more adjacency. But in the end, the, the plus one difference isn't going to be pretty significant. Shrines are pretty good. We've got some nice bonuses, but I think we've got to get some science going. There's builder first. Hmm...
Any chance we want to switch to Ilkum? You know what? Oh, that's nine turns. Um, no, I'm going to go campus first. And we'll see what we can do. And I want to upgrade you once we do have some money, but well, maybe I'll find something else. I don't think there's any reason to leave military units over here. I think I'm going to move a military unit into Hungry Hodor because it's not currently defended. We do have one near Rodical, so that's going to be all right. Yeah. Now, this builder's going to have four charges. Um, I'm definitely going to go do the wheat, which will boost our irrigation. Then I'll probably hook up the tobacco. I might hook up the other wheat. I might go like wheat, wheat, tobacco, and then with final charge, just walk down here or walk down to Rodical. I know I was going to buy this. Like, and that's the thing with the upgrade. We're probably delaying it. Hopefully we can get this. Again, um, so Nagarzagar over here. Nagarzargamu. Sounds like something like one of the random alien names from Rick and Morty. Um, almost certainly is going to go over here. Now, they their borders don't grow naturally. They just grow when people send them envoys. So hopefully not too many envoys early on to cause us some problems. We need tobacco, good next juice. Tobacco first you need for population. No, we need to we need to grain first so that we get the inspiration for irrigation. Right? So we go we go wheat. I mean wheat, tobacco, and then we consider whether we take the second week at that point. Um, probably. I think I wheat, tobacco, wheat, um, is the way it probably will go. Um, because I think it'll time out nicely. We actually might need a couple... There might... The uh, irrigation might not be right in time. We may end up going wheat, wheat, tobacco, but anyway, something like that. But we wheat first, definitely, so that we can actually get irrigation. Um, you drop down in production. Oh, why? Because you were working that, and now you're not. Yeah, you really are going to need some love before you do this. Honestly, maybe I should have just gone builder first in the end. I might just wait until we've got Ilkum and then switch it to building, which I kind of like the idea. In which case, I mean, shit. Because I could have used the production from the wood this whole time. I think I should have gone builder first, actually. Because I think I'm going to go builder now, after all, and then we would have gotten the extra production. We'll get a pre-banked in, and then in uh, in nine turns, we'll get state workforce. Because I don't think we're going to have one of these in time. We could... Uh, yeah, no. And there's nothing left to do. So we're not going to get the Eureka for state workforce, which is okay. Nine turns. We switch over to Ilkum. I think that's going to be fine. But yeah, I should have left the forest there. That was a slight mistake. I still only want a campus fairly early. But yeah. Oh, well. All right. We're going to put a cut in here because it is after four. We've got a run that's actually happening. We've got four cities down and a religion. I mean, we're, you know, far behind in our, our tech and culture production, although that's not entirely unusual. Um, we are going to put down another city here. Um, this is all before we get colonized. Oh, no, we've got colonization running right now. Um, we've got room for a couple more, maybe three more cities north of us that no one's ever going to compete to, so we don't have to rush. I'm going to get to five, and then I'm going to build up certain basics. Although, we might consider... Slapping down a sixth city over here sooner rather than later. In fact, like, what I'm going to do is I'm going to queue up a little move like this. And maybe like this. Maybe maybe this settler will actually settle out front here somewhere instead. Let me put a few map tacks to, like, just randomly, like, I'm just going to spam a bunch to try to remember that maybe I want to settle over here somewhere. Yeah, I don't know if these spots specifically, but just to remind myself, go west first, consider grabbing one of these two mountain pass locations, and then backfilling in over here, which might be better. So yeah, we're going to take off. That was two hours into the stream. Not that we got very far into this particular game because of all the restarts, but I'm happy with where we are. Looks pretty good, actually. Um, next live stream is going to be on Saturday, which is going to be some more Crusader Kings 3. Monday is going to be more to Sport Manager. Next Wednesday is going to be more Civ. Thanks everyone who came, uh, watched, followed the all the resubscriptions and everything today, and all the new subscriptions. Thank you very much for that, and all the contrib contributions to the whiskey and chocolate fund. Much appreciated. Stay safe out there. Um, happy Halloween on Saturday. Happy Sovin. Uh, stay safe. I don't know what you know Halloween's going to look like this year. Just be careful. Um, and uh, I'll see you in a few days, folks. Oh wait, I'm not streaming on Saturday. That's correct. I'm not streaming on Saturday because I've got Sovin-based activity on Saturday. There's going to be a stream, I think, on Friday instead. I'm not I'm not canceling the stream. It's just going to be offset by one day. Um, stay tuned, actually, 
We might be streaming on Friday instead of Saturday. Yeah. Hang on. I was supposed to figure that out ahead of time. Uh, I just remembered now that that was my intention. We'll figure it out! Keep watching Twitter. If you're a subscriber, watch the Discord. We'll talk about it on there. Uh, and anyway, I'll see you maybe in two days instead of three. Bye-bye, everyone. Let's go raid a Kiss for Lux channel.